Hey guys, welcome to Boxing Squared for boxing news and views from around the internet. With the news that Shannon Briggs has been banned from boxing for six months because of a failed drug test, the question has to be asked, is Shannon the Cannon done or will he rise again? The whole situation for me is a really, really sad one. Shouldn't have been like this. Let's rewind for a second. So Briggs, a 45-year-old former champ, made a return to the sport in 2014 after a well-documented hiatus of four years in which he was deeply depressed, overweight, and even contemplated suicide. The cannon overcame his demons and reinvented himself and his brand with the catchphrase, Let's go champ. Let's go champ! His personality, coupled with nine wins on the trot against mostly pedestrian opponents, let's be fair, put him in a position to fight for a version of the heavyweight title, the WBA regular title, in June this year against Fresa Quindo. But as we know, that would never come to pass, with Briggs caught with highly elevated levels of testosterone just weeks out from the fight. According to the WBA in their statement, Briggs opted not to have the B sample opened, and in recent days, he was banned for six months. Honestly, what was he thinking? What was he thinking? Had he been clean and got past a quindo, it would have capped a fairy tale comeback. It could have been one of those stories that ends up being a movie. Honestly, it could have been. The way I think about it, it's like climbing Everest, but then turning around on the Hillary step just before the summit. You probably noticed that Briggs has gone somewhat ghost on social media and the media in general since the failed test was announced. I mean, just look at his Twitter feed. It's mostly drivel these days. He's not calling out anyone or saying anything of note, nothing meaningful. I guess with this whole situation, there's two things to consider when we think of what's next. His brand, and does he have the wherewithal in general to carry on? Let's start with the brand side. I think his brand, it's shot. It really is shot. The whole let's go champ thing, it doesn't have the same ring or zing that it once did. The failed test, that really let the air out of the balloon on that one big time. His brand was a huge, huge piece in his comeback and who he was, the guy he'd become. He was a one-man marketing machine based on that one saying. It put him back in the minds of fans. No doubt, and I have no doubt that the merchandise side of this equation and that part of the business side, sure, it must be hurting right now. Uh, and plain and simple, people don't like to be associated with cheats. And he is a drug cheat now. His decision not to get that B sample tested, that has to be taken as an admission of guilt. Okay, two, can he carry on fighting? Let's face it, besides the let's go champ thing, a lot of us had questions about how much he really had left in the tank. That let's go champ thing, it really did sort of not cloud our judgment on him, but we were willing to give him a little bit of leeway because it, he was entertaining. He is 45 after all. And as we know, he's not going to be any better than he was in his prime. But Briggs does have power, undeniable power. If he hits you on the button, you're going to go. But he probably really only had four or five rounds at the most per fight that he was going to be at the top of his game. And where the top of his game was, we didn't really know. Because those nine fights since 2014, they went against meaningful fighters. And given he was going to be fighting against a Quindo, who was also in his 40s, I at least was willing to give him a bit of a pass for that fight. So let's examine this. We've got a shop-worn 45-year-old drug cheat with a shot brand. I'm not saying he can't come back, but it's not going to be easy. A lot of people have been let down and feel let down by Shannon's failed doping test. So I think it's clear he's not going to have the same support that he once did. It's a shame. It really is a shame. But he did it to himself. That's it from me. Hit like and subscribe. I'm out.